Hello everyone, welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. My name is Marina and today I'm going to be solving a problem for your PE transportation exam. So let's go ahead and get it started. A single unit truck makes a right turn from a 2.5% upgrade minor road onto highway operating at 55 miles per hour. The intersection side distance for a stopped single unit truck is most nearly. Okay, so to solve this problem, we're going to be looking at uh, some equations that comes from our Ashtol Green book. Uh, this is um, known as case B2 for a vehicle coming from a minor road and making a right turn into the major road. And we're going to look on our Ashtol Green book on page 9-45. And we're going to see equation 9-1 that says that our intersection side distance is equal 1.47 times the speed of the vehicle in the major road times T sub G. T sub G is the time gap for a minor vehicle to enter the major road. And um, let's take a look in our table here. So this is um, table 9 Point eight uh, for time gap for case B, right turn from stop. And we need to identify the type of vehicle that we have. In this case, we got one single unit truck. So our time gap is equal 8.5. Uh, but we have uh, some notes here that we need to pay attention. So let's see what the note says. For minor road approach grades, if the approach grade is an upgrade that exceeds 3%, we need to add 0 0.1 seconds for each percent grade by which the approach grade exceeds 0%. So our approach grade is actually 2.5%. So we, we are good here because this does not exceed 3%. So we don't know to you don't we don't need to do anything. Uh, so we can go ahead and plug the values in, into our equation. So we have that our uh, intersection side distance is equal 1.47 times the uh, speed of the vehicle in the major road times our t sub g. Uh, so let's input these values. We're gonna have that 1.47 times our speed. Uh, is 55 times our T sub G, which is 8.5. We're going to find that our intersection side distance is equal um, 687.22. This is most nearly uh, 6.88 feet. So this gives us the correct answer as option A. Alright, this concludes the solution. I hope you learned a lot and I see you next time.